Now, you've likely heard about just how hard it has been in the recent months for folks at a nursing home there. The residents there are pretty much held in quarantine away from their friends and their family for weeks or months at a time. Yeah, feeling isolation, but one nonprofit now taking the pandemic by the reins, literally, and bringing some smiles back to Texans with mini horses. Laura Lockheed shows us. We, we like them. We like them. And they like us the same way. <laughs> Little ponies making a big impact. If anything we can get to brighten our day, we're, we're all for it. As we say in Texas, this ain't their first rodeo for nonprofit minis and friends. Since the pandemic started, they visited dozens of nursing homes with a team of 10 trusty mini horses and donkeys peeking in through windows. I don't think everyone knows how difficult it's been. Um, you know, I mean, they can't even hug their caretakers. But today, Two of them, Snuggles and Buttercup, who is blind, visited the folks at Slayton's Library of Legacies, this time in person. She's so good. Oh, she's loving you, Rosetta. Getting to touch and, and see the horses kind of brings back memories from their childhood. It was especially meaningful for people like Shug Thomas, who grew up around livestock. They're, they're, they're a fine looking bunch. And even their health care workers who didn't. You're pretty. I'm not scared of you, but I'm scared of them biffles. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. Minis and friends hope they can touch the lives of people who might not have seen their families for weeks, one hoof at a time. We hope that these little guys can make a small difference for those people. You know, if it's just for that minute, if it's made a difference for them.